All right, everybody. So we did the Glade Xbox, and now went ahead and got a Mewtwo Xbox because it was also eleven dollars. <laughs> I didn't get as many of these. Um, at least from when I was looking around, I think the Glady Xboxes were just worth a little bit more, so I decided to get a couple of those instead. I could be completely wrong, and I maybe I uh, should have gotten a bunch of these, but you guys can let me know in the comments uh, before I start. Make sure to like the video, comment, subscribe, and uh, yeah, enjoy. So let's see what we can get here. They really got to make these things easier to open. I mean, I understand that they don't want people getting in the boxes and screwing around, but I feel like half the time you can't open these things without wrecking them. This wasn't too bad. Okay. Let's try to get this Mewtwo out without screwing them up. Nice and easy. Okay, good. Got them out. All right. Unfortunately, when they're in the promo like that, I don't know if you can see that. They kind of get a little bit of a bend to it. It's not awful, but it's enough to kind of annoy me. Anyway, let's leave it up, and then we'll take a look. Mewtwo EX. I mean, who doesn't like Mewtwo? Yeah, focus the camera. There we go. But, it's a pretty sick card. I've seen cooler ones, but, I mean, Mewtwo EX is always just, it's a Mewtwo EX, right? You're never going to be disappointed with it. It's a back for any of you graders out there. Okay, and then we have our monster Mewtwo card. You can't even see it. It's just too big. At least the back of this one isn't beat up as much, at least, as my Glade one was. Let me see if I can put them next to each other. Okay, we're good. And we got four packs again. Breakpoint, Breakthrough, Fates Collide, and Steam Siege. Alright. Breakthrough first. And by the way, don't fall, please. I'm going to put my phone here, so hopefully they don't slide. Cool. Uh, I did buy another box of the... Uh, Awakening of the Psychic King, so that video will be out, you know, sometime after this one. I have to get my Alakazam. I don't like this. A lot of these cards are already dinged up over there. That sucks, man. Heat more. I've never seen that guy. It's a new card for me. Fighting Belt Fury. That's kind of like what the sumo wrestlers were. I can't remember the name of the thing. Somebody let me know. Cloister. Temple. Trubbish. Phantom. Esper. Kind of like that guy. Ducklet. That's just about as generic as of a new Pokemon as it's going to get. Alright, cool. We got a reverse holo rare. Zeb Striker. It's actually kind of cool. And a Drapion non hollow rare. I'm going to sleeve up that reverse hollow. See, it's got like a bunch of nicks on the bottom and stuff. It's kind of a shame. On the Japanese cards, I got none of that. It sucks. It is what it is. A couple of these, these boxes themselves that were kind of banged up, Walmart did not 
do a good job of uh Oh, I opened this pack nice. They didn't do a good job of keeping their packs nice, so their box is good. But not really surprised. It's Walmart, right? Okay, card trick, two, three. These ones are nice. Probably just depends on the packs. Stunfisk. That's, I don't like him. Anyway, Buddy Buddy Rescue. Town Map. Magnemite, classic. Snubble. I have this card, I think, in my old collection. Remoraid. Don't do I think I have this one also. Piplup. A reverse hollow Axu. I like that guy. That's actually really cool. And a non hollow rare Bronzong. Not feeling this Pokemon. Not feeling it. I don't know, some of these new Pokemon, they're either really cool, or it's just like, what were you guys thinking? These packs are just not opening well. Like, they open easy, but that's why they just fall apart on you. Okay. Shuckle. Oh, Chinch Chinchino. Awesome, dude. Kangaskhan. It's not a rare. What the hell? Snivy, Snivy, Classic Jigglypuff, Fennekin, Snubble again, different artwork. Seal, a Duosian, Reverse Hollow, and a Moltres Rare. I actually got this in the Awakening of the uh, Psychic Kings box. I'm not feeling this Moltres. I don't know why. Some of you may hate me for that, but okay. So we didn't really get anything in this box at all. So hopefully this last pack is just a lucky pack. Hopefully we get a, a blue Gardevoir. That'd be insane. Get what's, a, get what's on the cover of the pack. Or else this could just be a dud box, which would suck. I mean, at the end of the day, you get the promo YouTube, but always hoping for something in the packs. Alright, wish me luck. Bra Braviary? Interesting name. Clang. Just Clang. Ninja Boy. Mareep. Clang and Clink. Ah, Pokemon. C dot. Pawnit. Ponyard, Drifloon, alright, that's badass, Reverse Hollow, Eavital, Gavital, it's a Reverse Hollow Rare, and that card is insane, holy crap, and then we have a Talon Flame non-Hollow Rare, so, we didn't get any EXs, or, I don't even know what comes in these sets, but, well, we didn't get any Hollow Rares, but, we got two reverse hollow rares, which is pretty awesome, and this, I can't pronounce it, but Yvetel is a very insane looking card. That's really nice. Wow. They did a really good job with that part of their reverse hollows, man. They did a really good job with that. Okay. Okay. Let me just sleeve up these two, and then I'll show you what we got for the video. Little, not like super disappointed in this box, but could have been better. Could have been better. All right. So reverse hollow Duosion. I reverse hollow Axu. Which, I, like I said, the bottom of this is just so cool. We got a Reverse Hollow Zeb Striker, which is a rare. Really cool card. A Reverse Hollow Rare Yvetel, which is one of like the nicest cards that I've seen in a while. Like I really like this artwork. 
and of course we get our Mewtwo EX which has a slight bend in it which I'm not happy about but hopefully if I put it on the bottom of a stack eventually it'll flatten out a tiny bit okay so that's what we got could have been better but it also could have been a lot worse those reverse hollow rares are definitely definitely awesome I'm going to throw a code card in for you guys here. And there you go. Alright. Thanks for watching. And hopefully in the next box I do, which is either going to be a Charizard EX box, or it will be a Snorlax GX box, we get a little bit better in the rare department, but I'm pretty happy with these two, actually. Actually pretty happy with those two. Thanks for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. See you in the next video, guys.